right, Disney and Hershey lovers. I'm Matt. I'm Alex. And happy opening Good day! day. Yes, yeah, so another off season has officially come to an end. So we are going to be showing you everything that's new this year, upgrades. Um, the new Skyrush restraints. Trains, Comet trains, uh, the Giant Side Pass Holder Lounge, and all that cool stuff. The, uh, yes. The old amphitheater, sure. which we did, we we did spot in our previous our our last video update that it appeared it was it was demolished. So that's going to be a construction site up there. So yeah, we'll so it'll be interesting to see what's going to be replacing that. Yeah, so yeah, that's something we'll keep an eye on throughout the entire and season. And chocolate cow too, is that they continue to add markings and cut down more trees. But we're talking about the amphitheater, yeah. which is in the park. So I mean, that's going to be another project we'll keep an eye on. Like, like what you said, Chocolate Town expansion. So, yeah, with, with, well, with our further ado, um, let's get in there. there. Let's check this out. All right, we are inside finally the inside the, the gate. Park. Yes, first time for me since New Year's Eve. Yes. Yes. Hello, everybody. Yes. Yeah, so, so we're gonna check this place out and see what, what, what see all the new stuff, all the upgraded stuff. And uh, that's what opening day is all about. So, what, meanwhile, a few of us got to stop and get our, our photo season passes up here for the for the year. Uh, if you don't know what a photo season pass is, that's a, those are good, unlimited from the opening day till the end of Christmas Candy Lane. That includes unlimited photo da digital downloads of all your ride photos and the Roman photographers in the park. So. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a great deal. Definitely and check that out. I must mention that the candy fruiters are definitely cool. Yes, that's right, yeah. Santa Claus photos during Candy Lane are not included with the photo, digital photo pass. You can have them at it along. So anyway, we're going to make our way up here, and we'll see you guys further into the park, okay? Oh, my goodness. The new Sky Rush, oh my goodness. Takes flight oh. on a different level. Oh. oh, that is crazy. Yeah. I think, I think, the new, the this, new, this, go ahead, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. The new tagline for this should be ready, ready for flight. Oh my it's goodness. It's the Pantheon. It's the exact same restraint. And Velocicoaster. Yep. And Velocicoaster. Yep. Just as amazing. Yes. I've been on Velocicoaster as well. So yeah, we all, the all, all, all three of us did. The same. Yes. I tell you what, it makes a world of difference. Oh my goodness. Absolute I've never seen I've never seen so many people cheering for that coaster since so probably since it's been here. Yeah. Oh or my not, goodness. Or a non-loopy coaster like not Hershey like Park. Coaster and Good job. Panther. Hershey oh, Park, you blew it out of the park car. on this. Oh my so, goodness. Yeah. It's definitely oh. rideable. And now I'm definitely torn between Wild Wildcats and Avengers. Oh, I, that's how I feel. I that's yeah, how I'm, I feel. Wildcats might have some competition here. Yeah, I agree. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hopefully you all got that. You got to see our first reaction on this. This is just amazing. <laughs> all right. Here's your. Here's our first look at the old amphitheater area. And uh, yeah, a good portion of it's gone, but the stage is still there. And not 100% sure, but I'm not wondering if that this may be used for dark nights, if the old stage might be kept for a dark nights area. Since this is part of the Creatures Uncaged maze, during dark nights we will have to see, but yeah, everything else is gone. If you can see right here, yep, all gone. Much, much clearer view of Great Bear now without it here. All right, so uh, we're here at Overlook. We're having lunch. And uh, as you can see around me, they completely redid this whole place. We'll sh kind of show you around a little bit here uh, inside the new layout in a little bit. But meanwhile, they got some new food items, including meatball subs. So I'm going to do a taste test here. We're going to try this thing out, okay? So let's uh, try this out. Very good. So if you're a, 
you're an Italian person, be sure to check this out when you're here. When you're here, if you decide to dine at Overlook Food Court, you'll be glad you did. All right, here's here's a quick here's a quick tour of the remodeled Overlook Food Court for you guys. Let's walk over here. And as you can see, they have two sides with the two main queues open. This side obviously is not open right now, but just to give you an idea why with, with less people around, down there is where the line forms the queue. Then you'll, you'll order your food right here. And you'll pay right here. They have self-checkouts over here, by the way, as well, if that interests you. And then the drink machines are right pay for your food after you check out, which, which really helps move the line through really quick. We couldn't believe how fast we, we got our food and, and were able to pay and get a table. So yes, hopefully this will, this will be a big improvement to the, to the big crowds, the overall crowds in here this year. And overall, it's just a nice brighter feel in here, a more uh, modern feel with the lighting. And it's, yeah, this is nice, very nice. Um, they opened some of this area up down here uh, to allow more seating for inside. So yeah, there's a lot more seating areas in here now. Um, excellent. So yeah, this is this is one of many numerous upgrades that, ha that has happened this year. So be sure to stop in here and, uh, and grab a bite to eat there in your next trip here to the park. We just got off Wildcat, our first ride of the season. Wow. It's hauling. Yeah, it was hauling today. Yes, you're right. Mind you, it's only down to two trains right now. Shouldn't be too much longer, though. Yes, it should be. And uh, something else that I've noticed was the brakes didn't seem to be as harsh into the brake run oh, today. So, yeah, if you weren't a fan of the brakes being so harsh at the end, you may be in for a treat there. They might have, looks like they may have fixed that issue over the winter. So, we're happy about that. Yeah. So now we're getting ready to check out the giant size lounge for you guys. So we're heading over there right now and we'll see you there. All right, guys, we are inside the giant size season pass holder lounge. And here you, where you can, if you're a giant size season pass holder, you get this privilege of coming in here. And they have places to sit right here. They also have free drinks right here in, the, in this soda machine they have vending machine snacks you can purchase and just a nice place to come in and, and unwind and I think they have charging stations too for your yes I believe yeah. at least that's what they said that's yeah said. charging stations to charge up your mobile devices so yeah this is so this is kind of what you can this is what you can expect so we wanted to give you a look at the, at the giant size pass holder lounge firsthand here. And mind you, this is at the base. This is located at the base of the Ferris wheel out in Midway. Uh, you can kind of you can see Lightning Racer right across the way. That's located at the base of the Ferris wheel, um, where the, the former Turkey Hill ice cream parlor used to be. This room will be air conditioned during the summer. Yes, heated in the winter, or, or, or as we assume, like for candy lane. So yeah, take if you're giant size, if you're a giant size pass holder, be sure to take advantage of this. And um, what do you think? It's really nice in here. Yeah. Nice place to come in on wine. Yeah. All right. Uh, we're meeting. We just met up with Coaster Jam and Photos here. So. Yeah, meeting all kinds of different familiar faces around here today. That's what you had to do on opening day. You meet, you find, you run into people you haven't you haven't seen since like last year. Right. So you do phenomenal photography work. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Yeah. So, what did you think of Skyrun? Love it. I, mean, I liked it before. Just make it a little bit more comfortable. Yeah. That's all they did. Uh, the station stuff's awesome. Yeah, the station is awesome. Uh, You're right. They need to have the courtesy. Though. 
What's that? The courtesy thing. Yeah. Yeah. Pick up the right courtesy. Yeah. So yeah, uh, good seeing everybody again. Uh, yeah. I met a bunch of people. Almost all my pictures are gone. So that's good. People recognize that's that. Good. So that's good. That's uh, good. But yeah, Wildcats running good. Yes, uh, we did. We did it twice, and yeah, the second time was even better. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna yeah. get back with Sky. Sky was a two-hour wait. So I was like, no. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So. Are we live? Yeah, that's the longest I think I've ever Hello. seen in a while. Hello. You know, like that. Oh yeah. 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 yeah so I'm like, yeah, well, definitely get that again. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. We just got off Great Bear. That thing was hauling. Yeah. Very busy day so far, but we did manage to do quite a bit. I mean, I hopefully I recover most of the new stuff around here for you guys. So just stay with us as we continue on here. I'm going to grab something to eat here very shortly. So, what are your thoughts on today so far? Busy at first, but then the crowd yeah, I think the crowds. I think the crowds are really starting to die off now. And then the amphitheater definitely looking like a Twizzler thing to ride. Yeah, well, it's going to be a ride for sure. I'm on this positive. What we're seeing up there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Bear was great. Bear was hauling too. Um, we just noticed something here. We wanted to show you guys. Okay. Look down here on the ground. There's a marking. There. Green survey markings. This is coming off up there, up top of that hill that we updated you on our last video update. So this is the same line, um, utility line that they're marking. If we walk over here, you can see. Yeah, but right here's a good, here's a good view in there. Green, more green survey flag. Now this is all tied in. This is all tied in to where the back there. Okay, so we're going to continue to keep an eye on this. Yeah, this line crosses right over this path. In fact, let's walk over here real quick and just take a look. Yeah, these, these uh, lines go right up back up, the, up into that construction area up there. Yep. Yep, so, yeah, well, we're going to continue to keep an eye on this for you guys. And um, lots going on here, lots of interesting stuff besides every what we've seen today. Yes. So, yep. All right, guys, um, here's a quick look at one of the Comet trains. Uh, new Comet trains by PTC, brand spanking new this year. And... Um, yeah, we're going to be taking this thing for a ride here very shortly, and we will have a review of what the experience is like and where the ride camera, photo camera is located. Um, one train operations today, it looks like there's a sandbag in the, on the floor, in the front car there. Uh, this is something you do not usually see that often, is one train operations at Comet. Hopefully they'll get the second train up and running here very soon. But yeah, we will have a full review of this for you guys when we get off. So we'll see you then. Also, the camera, um, it's located directly almost right behind the scrambler ride, so when you're coming down around that, that turn. You're coming down, you're going down that turn right before you start. The, it'll be, it'll the be on the left side of the train, yep. forward motion. So be, keep, keep, be mindful of that when you're riding if you want your picture taken. So yeah, yeah, we're very good. Yeah, we have to get a few more rides on it, you know, and let the trains break in a little yeah. more, but... Yeah, I'll put it this way. I'll put it this way. I, I like it better than Twister. Twister trains. True, I like it. Yeah. And it's Twister and Thunderhawk. It is a lot better than those. So yep. Yeah. All right. So uh, I think we're going to be wrapping up this this vlog today. So we just wanted to 
bring it to an end. We pretty much covered everything. Me, Alex, the Disney lovers of Hershey Crew, as well as I'd like to thank Roller Coaster B for hanging out with us again. Like we did, like, like just like last year, you know, yeah. got to hang out with a great con, got to see all the new changes and whatever. Yeah, I got the right guy rush. Yeah. Time, so. uh, what, what did you like about today? Everything. Yeah. The renovated over the Yeah. Floor. Yeah, so, um, yeah, we're going to wrap this up and, um, be sure to follow Disney Lovers at Hershey Park on our Facebook groups, our Season Pass Holder group, and our other Disney Lovers group, as well as Twitter slash X and Instagram, um, and as well as subscribe to us on Disney Lovers HP on YouTube to keep up with all the with all the happenings around here that we'll be doing this year. And um, if you, you saw a lot of the stuff that was going on around here, we will be just keep an eye on our channel, subscribe, and look, check it out. And that said, as we wrap up the wrap up this opening day, another opening day, have a magically sweet day, everyone. That's all for today's episode. We hope you enjoyed it. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel. If you have any comments, feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Check us out on our social media channels, including our Facebook group, where you can meet other fans as well as join in on the various discussions on, of both Disney and Hershey. Let us know what else you would like to see for future episodes on our channel. Until then, thank you for watching and have a magically sweet day.